Hello everyone, welcome to Steam Code. In this tutorial, I will be showing you how to make an idle game. This is just part one, so in this tutorial we will just be making the aesthetic, so like the buttons and the money and the logs down here. And in future tutorials, we will add functionality to buy logs, chop logs, buy items, and buy upgrades. Alright, so let's get started. So in the index.html file, first just start with the doc type HTML. Then in the head, we will have the title set to, you can set to whatever you want. I'll just be, mine will just be lumberjack idle game. And then link to the style sheet main.css and so href is equal to main.css and then we're going we're going to be using jQuery in this tutorial so we can just get the jQuery CDN And then lastly, just link to the app.js file. All right, so that's all we need inside the header. So now moving into the body. We will have a div called with a class of constant or content class equals content and then within this div we're going to have a div for all the menus so like the inventory menu the shop menu and so on and so forth and then we're also going to have a div for the inventory And then lastly, a div for the upgrades. All right, so within the menu div, we'll have two buttons. So the first button will have an ID of chop. And we can just say chop log. The second button will have an ID of visit. We can have to say visit marketplace. All right, and then inside of the inventory, we'll have a P tag. The ID will be equal to money. And within this, it'll say money colon zero dollars. And then we'll have another one. The idea of this one will just be logs. And then we can say you now own zero logs. All right, save that. Reload the page. Perfect, so far. All right, so now let's style it inside the CSS. So the first thing we're gonna style is the inventory, so dot inventory. We'll set the position to fixed. And we'll set bottom to zero, so it'll lay on the bottom of the page. And the width will be 100%. Perfect. And then the buttons 
we'll set the background color to white and the font size to 18 pixels perfect all right so this is all we're going to have for this tutorial in future tutorials we will add functionality to these to both of these buttons and we'll expand the game thank you for watching this has been steam code and have a good day